Tip was up bright and early, but Top was still asleep. When Top did finally open his shutters, Tip could see that he was half asleep and not in the best of moods. Tip had seen Top like this before. It didn't matter how much encouragement Tip gave him. Top seemed to be doing everything in slow motion. At least Top was awake now. They'd been walking for some time when Tip stopped. Top was quite out of breath. Last, Tip had found what he was looking for. He knew that this was going to be worth all the effort he'd put into getting up the hill. Top was really tired by now, but he loved eating berries, so he carried on climbing. Top had found the cart. But where was Tip? He was picking berries some way off. Which is just what Top wanted, because he had decided playing with the cart was going to be much more fun. But Top couldn't stop or even slow down. Top had had a lucky escape. The cart was ruined. What on earth could Top do? Luckily, Tip hadn't heard anything, but Top knew he'd soon find out, so he tried very hard to put the pieces back together. When Tip had filled the basket, he went back to where he'd left the cart. Top told Tip he didn't know where the cart was and that he had no idea what had happened. Tip wasn't happy at all. He could tell when Top was telling fibs. Top knew that Tip knew. There was no point in pretending. So he took his friend to the remains of the cart. As always, Tip had an idea. He would make another cart. When it was finished, Tip went back to fetch the basket. This time, there was plenty of room for both Top and the basket. 